Right, this is Transfer Talk. We're going to sit here and talk about the last sort of top five rumours May United related that have come out over the last week. First though, Flora. May yeah. United fan? Oh, oh yeah. Of course oh, yeah. she is. Oh, yeah. Exactly. Next thing, iPad. Phone. That's fair, isn't it? You've got right. the small... Just go on. Yeah, yeah. There, yeah, we'll go on. <laughs> Tiago Alcantara. What's We've spoken name? to Will Tidy from the Bleacher Report. Watch that video if you haven't already. The man gave us loads of information and he sounds like a superb buy, especially for the peanuts of £17 million. When you think about the kind of money that's thrown around for talented midfielders, that is incredibly low for the captain of the Spain under-21s European champions. So he's coming. Got in the final. Looks like it, which is something we hope happens. Uh, Football Daily have done a video all about him. Watch that as well, just in case you're not really sure, because, you know, knowledge is power, people. I got stories in the people's person as well. Tiago's father is apparently saying to Barcelona that he wants to come to Manchester United, which is always thank you, Tiago's dad. You yeah. are a wonderful. Why wouldn't he? When he was a child. Dad. When he was a child. When a Man United show, wasn't he? Treble oh, winners. I saw that photo actually. Yes, I who did. didn't? He's there. I don't know much about Spanish football. When you but see I'm a, take your word for it. When you see a team win the treble, you go, I want that shirt. I want to play for that team. Well done, Tiago. Come and join us, son. Right, moving on. Strutman. Well, Jack. Can we just first say with Tiago, should he come to Manchester United? Obviously. And will done. he? Yes, it looks like it. You think? Smash yeah, it. Right, Kevin Strootman, the young Dutch midfield maestro, who I'm very, very excited about. Uh, he's big, he's fast, he's got a shot on his left foot, uh, and he shouldn't be available for, uh, for two. He's going to do well with Carrick, I think. Yeah. Yes, definitely yes, going to do certainly. well with Carrick. Uh, 17 mil again is the kind of, seems to be the asking price for him there. And uh, after watching plenty of videos, I've been seeing him play a few matches. I'm, I'm thinking, yes, please. He's a good leader, yeah. too. He's a good leader, I he think. He is indeed. Uh, captain of the Dutch under-21 yeah. side. And he has also, I'm sure I read he's captain the, the senior side on one occasion pretty impressive. Well. Oh, the yeah. other thing about him is, Sky Sports reporting he is set on a move to the Premier League. So it's a case of pick him up for £70 million. Pretty cheap. If you add that to Thiago, £32 million for two superb uh, four young midfielders. Pounds. Good quick maths. Thank you very much. Anyway... <laughs> If he's dead set on coming to the Premier League, better we have him than, than Chelsea. Else. Although Tom Cleverley might not agree with us. There is a, Sorry, uh, a really, really good uh, article in Stretty News as well, which I was having a look at the other day, which basically gives you his whole profile and it's very useful. And, well, if you don't love him already, you will do once you read that. So give that a read. Coming Floor. then. Floor. Coming, set. certainly. He should come. He will come. It's on it. We're done. Um, it's not a done deal. Don't. I, that's not me. It's not a done deal, but it should be a done deal. <laughs> so on Rooney, we're in out, in out, shaking all about. What's he doing? Uh, Mail and Son say that he might be going to Barca, might be going to Madrid, might be going to Chelsea. All these things, but does he want to go abroad? I've seen he had a haircut. Have you seen he's had a haircut? Maybe that's because he's going to go yeah. abroad, hotter climates. I don't know. Um, but would what's her face, Colleen? Would she want to go abroad? Yeah, I don't really she, care. she would certainly want to go abroad, but I, I think she's the least important part of the Rooney saga. I think he wants saga, to stay. Yeah. I think he's going to have a chat with Moyes when he gets back next week, and he'll be he'll be here next season. That's my gut. I hope so. Deep in his little heart, I think he wants to stay with us. He's just he's had a bit of a crisis. He's a little boy. He's been top football since he was 16 years old. It's difficult when all of a sudden, for being the top dog, RVP comes in and does it instead. It's not that difficult. It's not that every other player in the squad settles down, works hard, gets their gets their minutes and is happy. He's throwing stories at the pram because we're not all I don't want to say anything disgusting, so I won't. But we're not doing things he wants us to do. And I think he's been incredibly disrespectful to Alex Ferguson, he's been incredibly disrespectful to fans, he's been very disrespectful to the club, and I'd happily ship him out if it could bring in Bale or Ronaldo or a top, top player. I can't see the point in selling him for thirty million just to put thirty million uh, in the bank. Uh, fresh but start, if we're bringing though. something in, get rid of him. It's not there's no point having a player who doesn't want to be there. We're Manchester United. We don't need someone who's going, oh, I want to be here. No one else is going to pay him what he's worth because he's not worth it. But it's not worth anyway. £250,000 a week. <laughs> I agree. I, 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 fresh start, on, fresh on. start. He'll be there. I agree with and how I the disrespect and all that. I hate it, but at the end of the day, he's been a Man United player for a long time. He may be... So is Tevez. Yeah. What, two, two years. years? Right, OK, so Flora, should he? Will he? Yes, Will he? yes. Will he? Willie. Definitely. Willie. Willie indeed. Moving swiftly on from Wayne, give me all your money. Rooney, Edinson Cavani. 60 million euros. Just 26 years old. Money he... could be spent elsewhere, but according to the Mirror, we're all over it. Daily Mail are also putting reports saying we're getting involved. I think this could just be agents at play saying, tell you what. He's a Chelsea player already. Once again, I just want to make sure everyone is aware that he is not as of now, a Chelsea player already. <laughs> but I feel he will be a Chelsea player. He's even admitted soon. himself, though, he's yeah. not worth that amount of money. Napoli Radio, uh, I read today, have said, well, they reported that they'd already signed, that they'd, he'd been sold to Chelsea 
uh, and then had to say, oh, sorry, that was an accident. A bit like, I think, the Man United Facebook page that kept going, Moyes is our manager. And they go, oh, no, he's not. Quick, we haven't announced it yet. Oh, Moyes is the manager. So it might be a bit like that. I think this is agent's being naughty. So Sam, should he, will he? <laughs> will he. Uh, should he, no. Will he, no. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, uh, moving on from Willies, uh, Cristiano Ronaldo of Real Madrid at the moment. We can buy him, it seems, maybe, who knows, but everyone seems to be saying it, the story will not go away. It's very, very exciting because he's God. Okay, the Daily Mail have reported that over the next few days, his agent and United representatives will meet. In the same article, they say... Both uh, parties will deny this meeting, so that, I mean, that makes it very plausible. But hopefully they will meet and they will discuss something and he will come home, which is where everybody wants to see where him. Where else would he go if not United? Yeah, I mean, he doesn't want to be at Madrid. He's not very happy at Madrid. He doesn't want, he's not bothered by the money that Madrid are offering because he could just stay and get incredibly wealthy. He's already very wealthy. So why wouldn't he want to come back and let us come lick his back. face? I, I hope he does. There's nothing I want more in the world than Ronaldo back at the club. But and, and I, I really I'm an optimist when it comes to this kind of thing, but I just I just can't see it. I want to see it, but I just I, I feel it'd be a bit too good to be true. I can't I can't see the day when Ronaldo returns. So I again, should he will he? Should he, yes. Will he? Maybe not. Right, well, that's everything we think, and we hope you feel a bit more informed now. We've spoken to you about transfers. We'll be doing this all summer because there's nothing else to do. We're just fans like you. That's our opinion. Let us know what you think. Leave it in the comments below. And subscribe. Yeah, subscribe. You look a bit like David De Gea. Brilliant. <laughs> just noticed. <laughs>